big responsibility for a 17 year old kid. You enjoy playing football? Notre Dame, touchdown! Do you think you're playing football? So let's take care of it! Hi, I'm Sean Farnham. Now this field and these stands may be empty right now, but that was not the case back in September when the Notre Dame Knights football squad embarked on their mission to three-peat as sectional champions. Now they knew the bullseye would be on their chest and they had a very difficult schedule. So the only question was, would they be up to the challenge? The season opened against Birmingham and there were many questions. Could the Knights contain the Patriots' speed and somehow slow down their high-powered offense? Was Notre Dame's defense up to the challenge? Those questions were soon answered. Next, the Knights sought revenge on a team that had beaten them the previous year, the Westlake Warriors. As the Warriors christened their new artificial field, Notre Dame looked to make it a memorable evening for Westlake fans and players alike. hit on all cylinders and steamrolled to a 41-6 road victory. After, well, let's face it, crushing their first two opponents, Notre Dame decided they'd travel up north, exit off the 14, and face one of their biggest rivals, the Palmdale Falcons. On that crisp September night, it turned out to be a game that wouldn't be decided until the seconds ran off the clock, which was an instant classic and a memorable one for everybody in attendance. From the opening kickoff, one could sense that this game was going to be a bit different. It was a hard fought battle as Notre Dame jumped out to an early lead. The Palmdale rallied to go ahead 15 to 14 with less than four minutes to play. The Knights it was gut check time. With time running out and facing a rejuvenated Falcon defense, Garrett Green and the rest of the Knights needed to drive 80 yards for victory, a drive that would define their season. Expected to do, the Knights pulled it out with the final.